welcome to how to install mods on your ARK server. ARK is a pretty fun game, don't get me wrong. I mean, there's so much to do with such a big map to enjoy. And add your friends on top of that, you're bound to have hours of fun. However, if you are a veteran and have beaten the game more than once, then you might want to look into spicing the game up somehow. Well, the best way to do that is with mods. There are plenty of ways to install mods onto your server, and today we're going over the best ways to do just that. Let's get started. Allowing mods on your server. The first thing that you're going to need to do is make sure that mods can run on your server. The first thing that we're going to do is head into the left hand side where you see the general settings. Underneath that tab you're going to click that, and then you're going to scroll down into the base settings area. Once you've found that, you're going to locate the drop down bar which is called allowed platforms. You're going to select it to just the Steam version, because Steam is the only one that allows the mods. Once you've made the change, you're going to click Save Changes down in the bottom right. Locating Mods to Install To find mods, the easiest way is to head into Ark Survival Evolved in Steam and locate the Workshop section. When that loads up, you'll be able to see a variety of different options of finding mods that you may want. For example, if you know what mod specifically you're looking for, you can use the Search tab, or you can use Most Popular, or even different types of add-ons that are available. Installing the mods. One of the quickest and most efficient ways to install the mods is directly in the Mods Plus Workshop section of our panel. When you're here, you can scroll down to see that there's a section called Popular Mods. Underneath this section, you'll see there's a whole list of a bunch of pages of different types of mods that are available. From here, all you have to do is select the one that you would want and literally just click it and it'll automatically add the active mods. The only thing you have to do from here is save the changes in the bottom right corner. This is definitely one of the most efficient ways to add mods for sure. But if you're looking for a different way to add mods, then you can head into your Steam Workshop for Arc Survival Evolved. And for this example today, I'm going to go ahead and use the search tab in order to find the Primal Fear mod. Of course, you can again use any other type of search mechanic that is out there for the workshop. But for today's example, like I said, I'll be using the search tab. So just type in Primal Fear and one of the first things that should show up is the mod Primal Fear. Just select that. In the new page that pops up, you'll be able to easily click subscribe to install the mod. However, that only adds it to the client side. We want to add it to the server. So scroll down a bit further and you should see the mod ID. If you don't see it in the description, you can also click the share link and at the end of the link is the ID in question. Copy either of these numbers and simply add them into the active mods section in our panel. Once you've added it there, you're going to go ahead and hit the green save changes button. You'll notice that it adds the mod. Changing mod settings. To change mod settings, you'll want to head into the file browser underneath the tool section on the left hand side. Once you load the page up, you'll take this path, arc se, then shooter game, then you'll take saved, once you've found that, you'll select Config, then Windows Server, and finally, GameUserSettings.ini. In this file, you'll locate a bunch of different settings that are available, and all you have to do is find the settings for the mod that you want to change. From here, you just change whatever you want, whether it be true to false or a different numerical value, and once you're satisfied, you'll hit the green Save Changes button down at the bottom. From here, you'll just restart the server. When you see this pop up, you hit the green restart button to double down, and that will get your mods all installed. Frequently Asked Questions Now let's check out a few frequently asked questions, shall we? The first is, why add mods? Whether they're big or small, mods can add a lot of flavor to a rather vanilla gameplay. So that's why. What are good starter mods? Well, there's a few out there that we recommend. First is the stacking mod, then there's the dino tracker, and finally, classic flyers. This variety of mods are super easy to catch on. 
do players need mods installed on client side? Yes, they do. Arc is so fancy that it does it on the server automatically when you join. Conclusion. That covers just about everything that we needed to for this tutorial, everybody. Hopefully, you found it helpful. If you did find it helpful, consider leaving a like, subscribing, and even ring that notification bell. That way we know this is the kind of stuff that you like to see. Until next time.